In this lesson, I am going to talk about one of my favorite topics, which is chocolate. If you are as crazy about chocolate as I am, you will want to find some ways to include it in a healthy diet. Chocolate is so delicious. Unfortunately, the largest percentage of calories in a typical chocolate bar comes from fat and cocoa butter. Much of it is saturated. To lower the fat, you can replace most of the chocolate with cocoa powder. Three tablespoons of cocoa powder is equivalent to about one ounce of chocolate. Then by adding just a small amount of real chocolate to round out the cocoa, the velvety richness of chocolate remains without all the fat calories. So choose a high quality cocoa powder. The cocoa should have a full rich flavor with no harshness or bitterness. Another factor to watch for is the amount of fat in a particular brand. The fat content can range from 10 to 20 percent, depending on the way a manufacturer handles the chocolate during processing. Still, in comparison to chocolate, which has a fat content of 50 to 60 percent, cocoa is clearly the preferred choice. Another strategy to eat less fat is just to use less chocolate in recipes or pair chocolate with other healthy ingredients. I think chocolate covered strawberries and dried fruit is a wonderful compromise between taste and healthy eating. When I need to make an, a dessert and don't want to make an involved recipe, I will melt some dark chocolate in the microwave and dip dried fruit like mangoes or apricot in the chocolate. Chocolate covered fruit is always a perfect dessert and homemade gift. Another option is to throw some chocolate chips in a healthy bread or cookie recipe. And if they are dark chocolate chips, you may still call it a health food. So do some experimenting with chocolate and cocoa powder and see how you can enjoy some healthy, delicious chocolatey treats. Let me know what chocolatey recipes you try and how they turn out. See you in the next lesson.